Yo, what's up? Welcome back to my playthrough of Horizon Forbidden West. Please like and subscribe. You can also click the bell to get notified when I post new videos. Thank you for the support. Let's do this. Alright guys, I'm going to be uh, completing some more side missions today. Can I ask what you're arguing about? Oh, so Riva won't let it rest. She insists our comrade Farika flew on the wings of the Ten. But I say, hanging on to a Stormbird for dear life isn't the same. A Tanakh throwed a Stormbird? She went up in the air. But road is a strong word. Ha! Huh, you admit it. You're talking about her like she's no longer around. She's not. After she grabbed onto the machine, it flew off with her to that mountain top. The Stormbird still circles the peak, but we never saw Farika again. Oh, that's not good. Sad. What a way to go. I'll say. A shame no one can reach that mountaintop. She was a great soldier with armor to match, and it serves no one lying up there. I'm a pretty good climber. No doubt, but unless you want to try what Farika did, there's no realistic way to get up there. For now. I don't care what you say, she flew. She flailed. Were you there? I saw it all in the distance. She thought, well, I will be. Actually, I don't see any other quests to do. <coughs> you, Outlander, come and trade. Okay, it doesn't look like we can do that mission just yet. Uh, so what we're going to do, we're going to find some other stuff to do. Uh, I think there's uh, some salvage contracts up in this area, so I'm going to go find them and we'll do them. An awesome cap. What are they doing out here? That would never happen. Genius is at work here. I cannot afford any distractions. If you require salvage, you can... Oh, a hunter! <laughs> yes, good, good. I was hoping one would stop by. There's no time to waste. Uh, Aloy. That old boar, Karaf, is expecting me to merely make the best armor in the Forbidden West. But I, Honda, will give him a masterpiece. And you are going to help me make it. Sure. Of course you'll be compensated. Good. Though seeing me at work should be gratifying enough. Maybe. You're one of Karif's people? So you're competing to make armor for him too. With the Tanakh right next door? Ha! They've got problems of their own to worry about. Besides, I'm not just making armor. I'm making a work of art. Imbued with the majesty of ancient machines and wondrous relics. With the steadfastness of the gentle plow horn and the fury of the raging ravager. So, where do you want to start? 
Uh, let's see here. Plowhorn. You talked about using plowhorn parts for your armor? I've been eyeing a herd not too far from here. If you can bring me the right parts, this armor will be as unwavering as they are. I can try. Oh, one more thing. Plowhorns sometimes leave a trail of flowers in their path. The Utaru infuse some kind of drink with them to soothe the mind. I'd like to try it, see if it inspires any ideas. Right. I'll see what I can do. You talked about using ancient relics for your armor? Correct. But that dream has fizzled like a wet forge. What do you mean? I acquired scouting reports on this area dating back to the Red Raids. They told of ruins filled with treasure. But some of our younger recruits stole the scrolls and absconded to go after the relics. I want them found before they run away with my salvage. I can try to track them down. Give them a good thrashing for me while you're at it, will you? So you want your armor to wield a Ravager's Fury? This sounds interesting. I tracked down a pack of them near here. Shoot off one of their cannons, and I can make my armor just as deadly. I'll, uh, take a look. See what I can do. Well, if you get to it, we'll pick it up when you're done. You said you wanted ancient machine parts for your armor? Ah, oh, yes. There's entire graveyards of them nearby. Dreadful things. With some of their parts, I can make armor that will instill fear and disquiet in the enemy. I'll, uh, read up on the details. Splendid! I look forward to your success. I have to go. Luck be with you. All right. We got some more scavenger contracts. Let's do the first one. Who cares we're into NAC territory? Those ancient machines Honda wanted me to check out should be close by. Maybe I'll read the contract one more time. Make sure I didn't miss anything. I think Honda will like this. My stash later. The old ones really put up a fight here. This should be useful. I don't think Honda will find this useful, but I might. But 
Honda will want this. I think that's all the salvage I'm gonna find. I should check out the other site Honda marked on her contract. I'd be closing in on the other ancient machines Honda wanted to salvage. Let's kill these Ravagers first. I think Honda will like this. I doubt Honda can use this for her armor. Maybe I'll keep it then. Ah, oh, this should be useful. this this will work these should be enough relics for honda's armor awesome now i just gotta take them to her honda's contract mentioned the thieves she's looking for might have come down this way i should take a look around maybe read the contract again make sure i know what i'm getting myself into here empty camp but the gear looks awesome could be from the thieves I'm looking for. Let's see if my focus can pick up a trail. Gotcha. These tracks should lead me to the thieves. Something happened here. A change of direction. Why? I should use my focus. See if I can find out where the thieves went. <gasps> Snap moss. Must have caught the thieves by surprise and chased them here. That's some bad luck. Guess I should recover Honda's scrolls then. The scrolls. They mentioned ruins by a metal tower. Maybe I should get the relics back to Honda. Make sure no one else gets hurt. There's the metal tower. Honda's relics should be around here somewhere.
An old world ruin. Might be worth taking a look inside. See what I can find. Be the relic. What? How do I get to them? There they are. Ah! Ah! Oh, I guess that's the way down. Ow. The machines Honda had her eyes on should be nearby. Better take a look at that contract of hers. Make sure I know what I'm looking for. Another one of those drones. I need to find a way to get to it before I can collect its data. There is the herd Honda picked. I'll need to stay out of sight if I want to get those flowers first. <coughs> Maybe I can climb something to jump onto the drone. flowers before they wilt. The <coughs> 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 pulse for my focus might help me spot these flowers faster. Yeah, I got them all. I need. Too bad I wasn't able to pick up enough flowers. But I think Honda can live without them. I should go back to her camp. Wait, I thought I, I did pick up enough flowers. The Ravagers Honda mentioned should be nearby. I just need to look at that contract one more time. Make sure I got all the details right. There they are. Honda wants one of those cannons. I'll need to shoot it off without killing the Ravager. Otherwise, I might damage the goods. I need to aim for that cannon. I got it! I can pick up that weapon.
See if I can get that Ravager cannon for Honda. Ow. I should grab that cannon and take it to the drop off point the contract mentions. should do it. I should let Honda know her crew can pick this up. I found the salvage you wanted, including relics from the ruins you mentioned. Found them when I tracked down your thieves. Turns out they got themselves into more trouble than they could handle. That's the Forbidden West for you. I, uh, got you those flowers you asked for, too. Yep. I'll finally be able to try that leaf water the Utaru rave about. <laughs> Excellent. Does this mean you can start working on your armor now? Not quite. I was taking a morning walk to clear my mind for the visionary task ahead of me. And I ran across a herd of lance horns. Swift, delicate, but vigorous. The best armor in the Forbidden West should be just as nimble. And I'll need their parts to achieve that. I might be able to hunt them down for you. That's all I needed to hear. I have to go. The best of luck to you. Honda's Lancehorn herd should be close to this area. Might be a good idea to read our contract again before going in.
Honda's crew should be able to pick things up from here. I'll just take some salvage back to camp like Honda asked. I've been seen. Honda's in trouble. I better deal with those machines. I'm just saying, have you ever tried punching a scrapper in the nose? <laughs> I'm telling you, it works. Damn scavengers! They're an occupational hazard, but still, it's a good thing you showed up. Happy to help. I brought you the Lancehorn salvage you asked for. This ought to make my armor shine like a spark in the night. Thank you, Aloy. Maybe you'll visit our main camp near Baron Light sometime. Bear witness to a moment in history as my armor transcends all others. Sure, if I can. Take care, Honda. All right, excellent. All right, I did see another side mission up here, so we're gonna go see what they need help with. Entire Tanakh village flooded. Maybe from a recent storm. Wonder if anyone made it out. Best check around the shore. There are a few survivors on that overlook. I should see if they're okay. Is he all right? Eh, uh, he will be. <sighs> there. But what about the others? Let me worry about that. Rest now. I'm Natika. You're a long way from the east, Outlander. I'm just passing through. What was this place? Bleeding Mark. The last storm caused a deluge that brought down half of the mountain. Ouch. The mudslide barreled right through the village. As you heard, we have many missing, but I need to keep watch on these two. I can take a look around. If I find anyone, I'll send them your way. Much appreciated. And if you see an older soldier, grim faced, goes by Kentok, uh, tell him. tell him I'm here. Might be able to use my focus to find any survivors. There. People Can in that anyone tower. hear us? Where are you? We're trapped in this tower. Flood blocked the way we came in. There's a ladder at the top, but we can't reach it. Okay. I'll find a way to get to you. I need to get to the ladder at the top of the building. Maybe there's a way to cross over from the broken one next to it. Any way to open that vent panel from underwater? Nope. Okay.
Doesn't look like there's a way to swim into the broken building. I need something to get me over the metal wall and inside. Here we go. We'll push this tree over. Timber. That works. Now I just need to climb inside to get to the top. Should be able to cross over to the survivors from there. Ah, there we go. There we go. There's the ladder on the other building. I can make that jump. Wait to make it drop? Oh, no! That was our only way out! I got you guys. Don't worry. I was trying to pull that. Who are you anyway? Everyone okay? You're not one of us. Sorry. Yes. We took shelter in here when a mudslide swept through the village, but debris blocked the passage we came in through. That ladder was our only way out, but we couldn't reach it from here. Don't worry. I'll find us another way out of here. Do you know what happened to the others? Before we ran in here, I thought I saw a few of our comrades climbing up a watchtower on the north side, near the grotto. I'll look into it. As soon as you're out, head for the shore. Natika's waiting on an overlook there. So she survived. Good. We'll join her as soon as we have a way out. Okay. Sit tight, for now.
should do it. Okay, you should have a way out. Thanks. We'll head to the shore in a moment. It didn't look like Kentok was with this group. Okay, better find this watchtower on the north end. Machines got us trapped up here. We lost our weapons in the mudslide. Sit tight. I'll take care of them. Those boulders. Break the support beam, crush the machines. Did the did the trap. Damn it. Crush him with the boulders. Shoot the support beam. almost dead. Frost isn't going to do much. Enough now. We're coming down. Is everyone okay? Better now, without snap maws prowling around. You sure know how to fight. We saw some of our comrades stuck on the eastern cliffs. They could use a hand too, if you're willing. Okay, I'll check it out. Have you seen Kentok? Natika asked me to keep an eye out for him. Last I saw him was before the mudslide hit. Okay. Head for the shore, on the other side of the village. Natik is there with the other survivors. Will do. Thanks again.
Outlander. Up here. We've got wounded up here. Need an easy way down. And fast. Uh, hold on. I'll figure something out. I need to find a way for the Tanakhs to get down from the cliff. That big crane could help. If I can get it into the right position, I could make a bridge for them. I will block me a base of the crane. Maybe I can clear it if I pull that beam out. My focus can help me search. Awesome. Okay, cranes in place. Now, how to lower it to reach the cliff. I should take a look at the bottom of the crane's arm. See if there's a way to move it. That beam, it should remove the counterweight and lower the arm. There we go. Oh, damn it. Arm's stuck on something. I better climb up and take a look. Touch those cables. The arms should drop the rest of the way. This thing's about to drop! Watch out! We're clear. Nice. Blood of the Ten. How'd you manage to do that? Because I'm Aloy. I don't know how you did it, but thanks for the rescue. Is everyone okay? His legs snapped against some debris as we were making a run But he'll live. How'd you get stuck up here? A mudslide tore through the village in the last storm. This ledge was just above the flood when we got to it. And by the time everything calmed down, the water had receded, leaving us stranded. And we couldn't leave a fellow soldier behind. Can you make it to the shore from here? Natika's there, tending to the wounded. Natika. Thank the team. We'll head for her location. She'll know what we should do next. Thanks again, Outlander. Okay. I think that's it for survivors. But I didn't see Ken talk among them. I should head back to Natika. Let her know.
Rest now. Aloy, thanks to you, these soldiers are safe. But where's Kentok? I didn't see anyone who matched his description. Do you know where he was when the storm hit? I was the last one to see him, just before. I told him I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the Chief's Guard, but he refused to discharge me from the squad. All Tanakht are stubborn fighters, but Kentok is more so than most. Mm. So I walked out. I was coming back from the opposite ridge when I saw the mudslide. You were coming back to make amends. I must find him. If anyone can survive such a storm, it's him. You said Kentok is your squad leader? I've trained under him ever since I was assigned to a squad. <laughs> He's tough as a shell snapper. Unforgiving as the desert. But my blade is quicker, deadlier because of him. And he taught me to fight for duty, not just glory. To serve something greater than yourself. Yes. And yet he wants me to be tethered to this place, rather than fulfilling a greater purpose with the chief's guard. Kind of, kind of, sort of reminds uh, reminds me of uh, Aloy and Rost in the bit, especially that bit about you know becoming something more and serving something like a greater a greater purpose. You said you wanted to pledge your blade to the chief's guard. Is that what the marshals are? No. The marshals travel the breadth of the clan lands, enacting Chief Hikaru's will. The guard remains at the grove to defend it and the chief. But like the marshals, only a handful are chosen for such an honor. So why did Kentok not want you to go? He claimed that the greater honor was to serve my squad and clan. But all we do here is gather supplies for ink. How can that compare to guarding the grove? The chief himself. So a mudslide did all this? Must have been quite a storm. We've had more and more of them over the last few years. Torrential rain, lightning strikes, winds that rattle the metal towers. But this last one was the worst yet. This area used to be as arid as the rest of the desert. The storms have changed all that. There's a water shortage in the capital. Could this help? The wound in the sand is low? Guess we're not the only ones dealing with problems. But unfortunately, no. This water is poisoned by ash blood, undrinkable as machine oil. Ah, uh, that's not good. What's ash blood? It's a red stone we gather. Our inker and scalding spear turns it into a pigment for the marks on our skin. In exchange, we get water. Every village in the clan trades with the capital for it. Food, machine parts. For us, it's ash blood. It's not exactly an exciting trade. I can take another look around the village. Where did you last see? Natika. I'm here. Where's Kentok? Did he make it? We're going to find him. He saved me. Pushed me out of the way as everything collapsed. But then the flood took him. Towards the gouge. The gouge? It's an ancient passage that leads deep underground. Come. I'll show you. Natika. We need orders. We're exposed out here. Only half of us can hold a blade if machines come. What do you want us to do? Go. The gouge is in the hillside, northwest of here. I'll catch up when I can. What are we going to do now? All right. Let's get a couple soldiers. Let's go. Oh, just, that must be the gouge. Looks like an old mine. There's a little spray blocking the entrance. Kentuck got swept in there. Let's clear some of it to get inside. Well, time to head in. Okay, let's see where this leads. Take it easy. You must be Kentok. Oh. I was an outlander, not my name. Natika sent me to find you. The soldier you saved told us you were swept away by the mudslide. And so, he made it. Good. And Natika. She came back. 
Yeah. She was on her way back to talk to you when the mudslide happened. She's looking after the survivors now. <sighs> it was my mistake to deny her discharge. A soldier is supposed to sacrifice for the good of the tribe. Looking back now, she was right. I didn't want to let her go. The chief's guard will gain an invaluable soldier. At least after all this, I won't be in the way anymore. I can tell you know a fatal wound when you see one. Oh no. My service to my clan is done. So... Leave me. No. You're not going to die down here. There has to be a way to get you out. There isn't. I tried to climb out, but it's no use. The walls are too slick. Water's coming in. From the surface? And not from where I came in. There must be another source. And if I find it, and open it up... You might not be able to move, Kentok, but I think there might be a way to move you. Hey. Hey. I need you to stay awake. I'm gonna take a look around. <laughs> You're just like Natika. Relentless as a fire claw. And you should be used to it. Just sit tight. I'm going to get you out of here. Alright, we got this. Leave me out. That there. waterfall must be coming okay. from somewhere. I need to get higher up to figure out where it's coming from. Coming from that vent. Dead end. There must be another source. I can't squeeze into there? Okay. There's some metal in that wall across the way. Might be able to pull some of it out. Ah. There. I think we can reach the other side now. saw down below should be coming in from somewhere around here. Gotta find its source. I can grab this from my stash later. Water's coming in from there. I can use the fire gleam to break open that wall. And this old place should flood. The raft can box on should float right up to the top. 
A way out. Almost there. Hey, stay with me. Tell Natika. You tell her yourself. She said you're a stubborn fighter, so keep fighting. Awesome. only to the hand that commands it he would say that every time we sparred sometimes as an insult <laughs> other times as a compliment but I guess he was right it was always my choice to stay or go I'm sorry you didn't get to make amends so am I what will you do now I'm not sure bleeding mark has a chance to recover and once that's done I could join the Chief's Guard, but I have to lay him to rest first. With full soldier's honors. Aloy, wait. You saved my comrades, somehow drained the entire village. I want you to have this. Thanks. And good luck, whatever you decide. All right, guys, that's where I'm going to end the video for the day. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed it, please make sure you hit the like button. And if you haven't yet, please consider subscribing. I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.